There we go. Oh, I think that's why. There's some in that font pack that are not meant for white, but black. So we were just selecting the wrong ones. Comes in going like that just seems so weird. Here we go. The insides were hollow. No, didn't want that. Here we go. I'm sorry, not worried. Here we go. Perfect. There we go. We'll just rotate it around. Just get a few more uses out of that brush. Go around. Cool effect, but now we're one. Okay, we'll just kind of come in here and start making sparks. And uh, see where that gets us. I'll probably create one that kind of points up to him, kind of meeting towards the electricity. The big one's shooting off. Get the T. Nah, I like it to come over like that. There we go. Kind of rotate this thing around. Shrink it. Let's turn it down. For the most part, we want it going away, but we'll have a few little stragglers here and there. So, and I think that again is yep, that inverse type of. Uh, and I think, yeah, we're going to end up adding some to him up here. I think. Just to kind of add some electricity, but we'll get to that later. I'm to try to finish off, finish off all of these. Close. There we go. Maybe click you. Okay, I'm gonna rotate it. To kind of about right there. And really small. Again, we're just gonna kind of click around and hopefully they'll uh, create some going in between the characters and kind of get our way of some stuff being close to the same. I mean, it's not gonna be exact. But. Electricity going through there. There we go. Rotate this around. There we go. So, anyways, you get the idea, I think, of how this lightning. We just go around, and we're just going to add. Lightning all over the place. I'm just going to quickly, just to end it, just kind of quickly go through and just add some different places all over. Just to kind of quickly. This is taking too long. Ooh. You're going to be able to tell it's probably the same. I'm just going to go through them just quickly. Get a little bit of variance in it, not much, just enough. Just to give it like a feel like there is some difference in stuff and things. Kind of erase the tool and we'll do the same thing in there too. It's kind of erase some stuff. And See what you can get it to make it look like. Okay. So once that's finished, now we're going to finish the finalizing touches on electricity coming through here. So we're just going to put one nice big lightning bolt coming up, I think, right through here on the uh, neon.
Oh, my eraser is selected. Huh. Oh, sometimes. Sometimes. Okay. Okay, so now what we're going to do is work on these inside here to try and get him to appear a little more opaque, at least in the sense of there being a little layering. So we're just going to select transparency of that and then come down and put a little mask right here, invert it, and same thing with this. I'm probably going to keep that one, but this one we are going to uh, just drag and copy this down. You can copy it by holding alt and just dragging right down there. Yep, there we go. So you can kind of see how that creates a little needle little effect inside of him. Okay, and then we'll just go through, inspect it, see how it looks. I think it's pretty dang good. Not much more else I think I would do. So there you have it, creating a simple electricity effect. Uh, using nothing but brushes and layer styles. Uh, thanks, this is, this is again just my first video. Got many, many more uh, to go of all kinds of different images and very cool effects. So I uh, appreciate you taking the time to watch this. Hope it was helpful. Thank you, bye.